have about, I think it's about 52,000 people participate in this trial. And it's just for patients on traditional Medicare. It's not for like a Medicare Advantage plan. It's not for someone that's not on Medicare yet. The idea is that uh, it's looking for atrial fibrillation. It can also pick up other irregular heart rhythms too, but it's looking for atrial fibrillation for patients. This is for patients over 70, because as we get older, the risk for everybody goes up for atrial fibrillation. And if you don't know you have atrial fibrillation, it raises the risk significantly of having strokes. And then again, not everybody survives stroke or they may be paralyzed in one part of the body. So it's an important thing. Well, the idea is um, to try and pick up patients before they know they have this because a lot of people are not symptomatic. And so the idea is to prevent them from winding up in the hospital and prevent them from having a stroke. And it's really the stroke prevention is the biggest thing, but who wants to be in the hospital for two or three days and have a hospital bill if, if you can avoid that as well for just by getting a medicine as an outpatient. You know, definitely very helpful and it's very easy. I mean, a patient comes in, they sign the papers consenting they can be in this and Medicare can track their data. And, and we put the monitor on right then and there. It's a, it's literally about the size of a band-aid. It goes on the upper chest area. It's about the size of a large band-aid. They just peel it off in two weeks, put a little envelope and mail it in. They, they don't have to come back for a second visit. It's, it doesn't take up any time. The only thing they can't do is swim with it on, but they can take showers because it's a very special type of monitor. It's just this little band-aid device that's on their chest and that's it. There's there's no wires, no power pack. So it doesn't interfere with sleeping and, and, and showering and stuff. So, uh, so it's a great study. It's simple but providing you know, uh, information that's potentially going to help everyone over 70 in the future, you know, as far as you know, the care they receive, as well as our patients that are in the study that, that are like, you know, at the small percentage, but percentage of patients that are picking up that there's something irregular they didn't even know was going on with their heart rate and heart rhythm. So, uh, so it's, a, it's a great study.